Welcome. This presentation is which safe class should I take and is presented by Agilist. This is an explanation of the various scaled Agile framework classes that we offer, what you should expect to learn from them, and information on who should choose to attend them. Agilist provides training and consultation services supporting Agile transformation and scaling, DevOps implementation, and Agile training. Agilist is a scaled Agile goal partner. We tailor the methodology, strategy, and roadmap that we deliver for the needs of the organizations that we serve. In a major transformation, a critical step is to train everyone, but for maximum value, the training needs to be specific to each participant in the Agile organization. My name is David New, and I'm a safe trainer with Agilist. I have over 20 years of IT experience, and I'm a certified SPC. I also have several other safe certifications, such as the POPM and RTE. A common question that I see in Agilist training sessions is, where do I fit in and what safe class do I need to take? Often when I hear this, the individuals asking the question is already in my class, and sometimes we find out that they have chosen the wrong class for their role or desired career path. In this presentation, I'll attempt to help guide you to the correct course for your role. If you're here, it's likely your enterprise has already started to embrace SAFE and you're trying to make certain that you remain relevant as the company begins its transformation. Looking at the SAFE big picture, you've probably noticed that you do not see the title for Business Analyst, Project or Program Manager, Development, Release or Support Manager, or many other roles. You probably are concerned that you don't see your own title there. There's no need to be concerned. SAFE does not eliminate any titles from an enterprise. The reason that you don't see those titles listed is that the big picture only has room to display a few key roles and they center around the ones that have specialized SAFE training. Our most popular course is the Foundational SAFE course, Leading SAFE. This course is ideal for those that are brand new to SAFE or for those that are in the roles of leadership in the company. During this two-day course, attendees will gain the knowledge necessary to lead a lean, agile enterprise by leveraging the scaled agile framework, its underlying principles which are derived from lean systems thinking, agile development, product development flow, and DevOps. The participants in this class will gain insights into mastering business agility in order to thrive in the competitive marketplace. They'll discuss how to establish team and technical agility and organize and reorganize around the flow of value. They'll also get to learn and practice the skills for supporting and executing PI planning events and coordinating multiple Agile release trains. Participants in the class will get to explore the importance of adopting a customer-centric mindset and design thinking approach to Agile product delivery. Learners will also get to develop an understanding of implementing lean portfolio management function in their enterprise. Attending the class will help prepare the individual to take the exam and become a certified safe Agilist. The topics that we will cover in this class are thriving in the digital age with business agility, becoming a lean agile leader, establishing team and technical agility, building solutions with agile product delivery, and exploring lean portfolio management. The leading safe course is designed for individuals with no prior experience in SAFE. However, you should have a solid understanding of the software development lifecycle, and you should have some experience with Scrum in order to grasp some of the SAFE concepts. All are welcome to attend this course regardless of their experience. However, the following prerequisites are highly recommended. Five plus years experience in software development, testing, business analysis, project or product management, and experience in Scrum. We recommend this class for anyone in a leadership role, as well as project and program managers, business analysts, and team leads. This class covers the foundational principles of SAFE, and it also includes a PI planning simulation. This course is an excellent choice if you regularly communicate with upper and middle management. Being able to share a common vocabulary will assist those traditionally in a project or program management position. The SAFE Scrum Master course is a two-day course in which attendees will gain an understanding of the role of a Scrum Master in a SAFE enterprise. Unlike traditional Scrum Master training that focuses on the fundamentals of team-level Scrum, the SAFE Scrum Master course explores the role of the Scrum Master in the context of the entire enterprise, and it prepares the attendees to successfully plan and execute a program increment, which is the primary enabler of alignment throughout all levels of a SAFE organization. This includes learning the key components of Agile at scale development, how Scrum is facilitated throughout the enterprise, and how to execute iteration planning. 
Attendees of this course will discover how to build high-performing Agile teams by becoming a servant leader and coach, and how to coach those teams to deliver the maximum business value at scale. Safe 5 Scrum Master Certification signifies that the certified individual is prepared to perform the role of a Scrum Master in a safe environment, increasing their value to teams and organizations which have chosen to implement SAFE. The topics covered during this class are Introducing Scrum in SAFE, Characterizing the Role of a Scrum Master, Experiencing Program Increment Planning, Facilitating Iteration Execution, Finishing the Program Increment, and Coaching the Agile Team. This course is ideal for those recently assigned to a Scrum Master role. The responsibilities of the role to the team will be explained in the class and you will learn how to prepare and participate in PI planning. All are welcome to attend this course regardless of their experience. However, the following prerequisites are highly recommended. Familiarity with Agile concepts and principles, awareness of Scrum, Kanban, and Extreme Programming, and a working knowledge of software and hardware development process. We recommend this class for new Scrum Masters who are new to SAFE. This does include a PI planning simulation in this class. In the POPM course, you will develop the skill sets needed to guide the delivery of value in a lean enterprise. During this two-day course, attendees will gain an in-depth understanding of how to effectively perform the, their role in the Agile release train as it delivers value through program increments. Attendees will explore how to apply lean thinking by decomposing epics into features and stories, refining those features and user stories, and managing program and team backlogs, and how to plan and execute iterations and program increments. Attendees will also discover how the continuous delivery pipeline and DevOps culture contribute to the relentless improvement of the art. The topics covered in this course are becoming a product, owner product manager in the safe enterprise, preparing for PI planning, leading PI planning, executing iterations, and executing the program increment. The POPM course is designed for those who provide the definition of what needs to be built to the teams. This is a technical role, and this course will help you understand how to create the communication that explains the work request. It is approximately 70% focused on the product owner role and approximately 30% focused on the product manager role. This role is often performed by those with the background as a program or product manager, a business SME, a business analyst, or a technical lead. The product owner should be able to translate business requests into functional work items. The product manager should be able to translate client requests into features. We recommend that you have attended the Leading Safe course at first, if possible. Ideally, you would like to have some experience with Safe prior to taking this course. The Safe Advanced Scrum Master course is a two-day course that prepares current Scrum Masters for their leadership role in facilitating Agile team, program, and enterprise success in a safe implementation. This course covers facilitation of cross-team interactions in support of program execution and relentless improvement, and it enhances the Scrum paradigm with an introduction to scalable engineering and DevOps practices, the application of Kanban to facilitate the flow of value, and supporting interactions with architects, product management, and other critical stakeholders in the larger program and enterprise context. This course offers actionable tools for building high-performing teams and explores practical ways of addressing Agile and Scrum anti-patterns in the enterprise. The topics covered in this course are exploring the Scrum Master role in the safe enterprise, applying safe principles a Scrum Master's perspective, exploring Agile and Scrum anti-patterns, facilitating program execution, improving flow with Kanban and XP, building high-performing teams, and improving program performance with Inspect and Adapt. While all are welcome to attend this course regardless of experience, we highly suggest that you first have an SSM, a CSM, or a PSM before attending, and we recommend that you have at least three months of experience working as a Scrum Master in order to fully understand the concepts presented in this course. The SASM is the natural progression for a Scrum Master with a SSM, a CSM, or a PSM. If you already have a CSM or PSM, then you may want to consider taking this course and skipping the SSM course. The RTE course is designed to help you facilitate and enable end-to-end -end value delivery through Agile release trains and learn 
How to Build a High-Performing Art by Becoming a Servant Leader and Coach. During this three-day course, you will gain an in-depth understanding of the roles and responsibilities of an RTE. You will examine the RTE role in a Lean Agile transformation and learn how to facilitate art, ex art execution. You will also learn how to coach leaders, teams, and scrum masters. This course explores how to prepare, plan, and execute a PI planning event. The topics covered in this course are exploring the RTE role and responsibilities, applying safe principles, organizing the art, planning a program increment, executing a program increment, fostering relentless improvement, and serving the art. The RTE is the chief scrum master of the art, and this role is responsible for shepherding value delivery. As such, this is an extremely challenging position, and it is focused on facilitation and leadership. We recommend that anyone that is looking to fulfill the role of the RTE take this course. However, you should already have a very solid understanding of SAFE, already have at least one SAFE certification, and you should have previously participated in at least one PI. In the SAFE for Government course, attendees will learn the principles and practices of SAFE, how to execute and release value arts, and what it means to lead a lean, agile transformation of a program inside a government agency. This is a two-day course. Attendees will gain an understanding of the Lean Agile mindset and why it's an essential foundation for transformation. They'll also get practical advice on how to build high-performing multi-vendor Agile teams and programs, managing technology investments in Lean Flow, acquiring solutions with Agile contracting, launching the program, and planning and delivering value using SAFE. Attendees will also learn how specific leadership behaviors can drive successful organizational changes in government. We recommend the following prerequisites, a foundational understanding of the Agile Manifesto, the Safe House of Lean, and the Safe Principles. We supply pre-work suggestions for you to prepare for this class. That you will also need a foundational understanding of the full life cycle of government technology programs. Please note that registered attendees will receive a list of readings and videos specific to Agile and government that will be helpful to review before attending this course. Safe for Teams is a two-day foundational course designed for the Agile team members, both developers and testers. This course is often provided by companies right before launching their first PI planning event as part of a quick start PI. Safe DevOps is a course that is designed to take your Agile teams to the next level by bringing development and operation teams together to deliver faster speed to market and build in quality. Agile Software Engineering is focused on taking the technical practices of XP, BDD, and TDD and applying it to SAFE. SAFE for Architects is a course designed to help system, solution, and enterprise architects Learn how to align architecture with business value and drive continuous flow to large systems of systems while supporting safe program execution. The Lean Portfolio Management course is focused on aligning strategy with execution and is for individuals working in strategy and investment funding, agile portfolio operations, and lean governance. Focus is on the portfolio level of safe. Agile Project Management is designed for those in the product manager role. It is recommended that you either take the POPM course or the SA course prior to this one. This course is approximately 70% focused on the product manager role and approximately 30% focused on the product owner role. Safe classes allow a natural progression through different roles and responsibilities. For example, for new scrum masters, they can start their new role with an SSM certification. Once they have some experience with an Agile team, they can build on their leadership skill set with the SASM's course. If they wish to take on still more responsibility later, they can step up to the role of an RTE. A very experienced RTE may be called upon to become a solution train engineer, also known as an STE, later on. Another example is on the business side. A new role for a technical SME or business analyst might have become a product owner in which they would like to have a foundational knowledge in SAFE by acquiring a SAFE Agilist certification and then obtaining the Product Owner Product Manager certification later. Still later on, they may wish to progress up to a Product Manager and help define the features being delivered by working directly with the business owners or client. 
In that scenario, they should probably obtain the Agile Product Management Certification. Developers and testers also have a career path in SAFE. The first step is becoming a certified SAFE practitioner. And once they understand how to execute with SAFE, they can then look to improve their speed of execution of delivery with the SAFE DevOps certification. Later, the team can target improving even more with their delivery execution with the Agile Software Engineering Certification. Our techs, architects are also included in the framework. We recommend that they learn and certify on the foundational elements with the leading SAFE course first, then acquire the SAFE for Architects certification. If you sign up for a course, you will receive the following. An attendee workbook, which is a copy of the slides that are going to be presented in the class, preparation and eligibility to take the related SAFE examination. The first attempt to take a related class exam is already built into the price of the class. Once you complete the class, a learning plan is created and assigned to you, and you can access all of the related study materials and take the exam. As part of completing the course, you'll receive a one-year membership to the SAFE community platform where you can then be able to access additional SAFE materials and the ability to a network with other professionals who can help you answer your implementation questions. Additionally, you can explore career opportunities for certified SAFE professionals. You'll also receive a course certificate of completion that shows you attended the class. Please note that all attendees must attend all days of the class of each course in order to be eligible for the exam for that course. By now, you should have a good idea of which SAFE class you would like to take. The next step is to sign up for the class. You can see all of the SAFE classes that Agilist offers at the link on the screen. If you experience any difficulty, please reach out to training at agilist.org and we will be happy to help you sign up for a class. If you would like to have your company obtain training on site, we would love to work with you. Please feel free to reach out to us via email or telephone. If you'd like to learn more about the company and the services that we offer, including our consultation services, please visit us on the web at agilist.org. We at Agilist would like to thank you for your attention and we hope that this presentation has provided you with the information that you were looking for. Thank <laughs> you.